Jordan, welcome to Norwich City Football Club. Uh, how do you feel to get the move across the line? Really delighted. It's, um, as soon as I knew they were interested in taking me, it was a decision that I wanted to move quick and to come here is, is brilliant for me and I think it's for my family as well to try and get settled again and, and get going, hit the ground running. Can you tell us a bit about your sort of pathway to this point? Because for those who have followed the championship, they'll probably know you and your goals from the last few seasons. Um, for those that haven't, you, you're a bit of a latecomer to the professional game, is that right? Yeah, I was. I mean, I was, I was working behind a bar. That's how I started off. I was working behind a bar for a bit and then I got my chance at Port Vale, moved to, moved to Preston and then um, kind of flourished at Preston to um, I moved to West Ham, which um, I was absolutely buzzing at the time, but things didn't go the way I wanted them to go at West Ham. But it's led me to here, which I'm, I'm relishing the challenge for now. Yeah, and you had a little bit of a taste of the Premier League at West Ham. Um, I'm sure you're hungry to hopefully in the not too distant future experience it fully here at Norwich. Yeah, it's, it's one of the main reasons why, why I've come here. It's um, to get the club back in the Premier League and it's to, um, to prove myself in the Premier League again. So I, I believe that I'm a Premier League player and so does the manager, Stuart. Everybody here believe that I'm a Premier League player too. So for me, it's to get this club back to where they want to be. And for me, it's to prove a point. And what were the other factors that convinced you to join this club? I mean, you, um, you look around at the time I got was a tour at the, the uh, training ground and it was, more importantly, it was the confidence the manager Stuart showed in me. They, as soon as they realised that I could be available, they, they struck and they wanted to get to know me, get to know my personality, get to know what I'm like around the training ground people and my work ethic. And it was um, for someone to show that confidence in you, you can only admire it. So for me personally, I want to sh put my faith in in the manager, everyone else here, and to do what I can do over the last few years and prove myself. And what do you think Stuart and Daniel are going to be sort of looking for from you this season? Um, goals. <laughs> That's what a striker comes in for, is uh, goals. And I think that I had my best scoring season in the Championship last year and I can only improve on that. And that's playing mainly a full se season injured as well. So now I'm, I'm fully fit, raring to go, and hopefully I can improve on that 15 goals that I scored last year. And, maybe reach the 20 mark. Would you say you're a different sort of type of striker to the ones that we have here at the moment? I know in, don't know how much you saw of Norwich in the championship winning season, but you had sort of Jordan Rhodes complimenting Timu Puki with goals and assists. Would, are you looking forward to working with Timu and are you a different striker? Yeah, most definitely. I mean, as I said, I saw a lot of him in the championship and what was it, 40 goals or something in the championship? So you can only be excited by a prospect to work with someone like that and to hopefully add to help him score goals and for him to help me score goals. So that's, that's why I've come here, I think. A lot of people now know what I'm about as a, as a footballer. I'm a big physical presence who, who will bat a defender around quite old school in that, but I'm also a very powerful striker who can get in the box and get on the end of things. So for me personally, I want to come here, I want to, I want to excel, I want to score goals, and I want to, more importantly, bring good performances. And Kieran Dowell is another player who recently signed with a bit of a championship experience. Um, what have you made of the squad that's been assembled here over the last few weeks and months? I think it's um, what the club's done brilliant. I think that the main thing is they've kept hold of the, the team that took them up last time and, and the team that rewarded them with a time in the Premier League and they've managed to keep hold of a lot of them so far. And I think it's brilliant for the club and I think it can only go one way. Yeah, have you had a chance to meet any of the lads yet? Do you sort of know anyone here already? I uh, was with Sam Byron when um, at West Ham, so I, I know him. But I, I'll be honest, I'm, I'm a people person, so I, I get to know people quick. And uh, I'm a, I'm, I'd like to think I'm a good personality anyway. So it's uh, I'm looking forward to meeting everyone and to getting to know everyone. But I think more importantly, I'm looking forward to succeed with everyone. Yeah, and of course, shortly after this interview, you'll be sort of flying off to Germany. You must be looking forward to, uh, like you say, getting to know everyone, sort of helping build the team chemistry in the dressing room on. Pre season Yeah, definitely. I think that's what pre seasons about is, is getting to know how people play, the, the, if each and everyone's styles of play. And more importantly, is to build a bond with the team that obviously is, is new to me and it'll be new for them to play with me. I'm sure they may have seen me play before, but I think getting to know me as a person and a player is, is completely different to playing against me.